from David Letterman's on-air confession, uh, having had sex with staff members, continues. One question being raised is whether Dave is guilty of sexual harassment. Well, it's, there are a lot of different definitions for sexual harassment. But I think that my issue, I don't really care that he got nookie. I don't care. And a lot of people don't care. And he's not a politician, so we don't have to really hold him to that standard. So let's just move on from that. The only thing that I don't like is that the girls that he's sleeping with all got promoted. Not necessarily. No, that's not true. Well, all right, let's, I'll just say this one Stephanie did. She was on air, this girl. Uh -huh. She got favoritism. That's the thing I don't like. It's tit for tat, Joey, so to speak. can I ask you this? Do we, know, do we know if the girls that he didn't sleep with, because there's no record, do we know if the girls that he didn't sleep with didn't get promoted as well? Well, it doesn't matter. Them? This one did. Let's just but, talk about this but if one. You got, okay, if you got five that did get promoted and one that slept with and that also did, then it's, it's really... I have I never worked on a show where there wasn't... Uh, when, when the boss... I have to think, didn't show some favoritism that didn't necessarily mean that he slept with them and so on. Uh, you know, you and I were talking about it. When you work in the show, especially in television, and you're working late, these are the women you meet. There is no record yes. at all with David Letterman of his having promoted someone or having tell, told someone, if you don't do this, you're not going to get the job. I mean, I've worked with, on that show a lot and talked with the writers who are women and so forth. But, you know, there oh. used to be a, a rule in network television oh, that if, there were, if you were having a, a, a romance on a certain level with somebody on the show, that one or the other of you had to leave the show. I know. What happened that, to that rule? That, that, no, longer, that no longer happens. That no longer happens. I beg your pardon. Said, I said, am you? I going or are you? Because of our relationship. Because of our relationship. No, do you, no, I tried not to show that you're my favorite. <laughs> well, you see, here's an example. I She's tried. kidding. She's kidding. Yeah, kidding. But let's say, oh, yeah. let's say kidding. one of us was sleeping with Bill Getty. Fat chance, but still. <laughs> I mean, I love him, but we're not going to do that. So let's say one of us was, and okay. then one of us got more airtime. This has happened on a lot of shows. Yes. You know, and I just don't, I think it's naive I, to think that it's an obvious quid pro quo, that it's, oh, if you sleep with me, I'll give you a promotion. Not, he's not a dirty old man. Joy, it's not sexual harassment. That is very important. That was just told to me in my ear. If you would tell me one more time, and I'll repeat it, because it's important. Uh -huh. The Letterman Show has a very good track record of promoting women. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. And most of their high-level executives or EPs are women. So this is not, it does not seem to be tied to that. I I'm shocked we're still talking about it because, as I, I said to somebody earlier today, I'm sorry, he was not married. He was not. When you are married... I understand because I've been taught by the girls on this show <laughs> that when you are married That's and you yeah. have a... I don't agree with that. I, I have, Let me finish it and then you can disagree. Finish. I know, but let me finish. God, let Go me finish. I know it's your birthday, Go damn ahead. it. See, I would let you finish because you're my favorite. <laughs> Shut up, Joy. Let her finish. But what I've, I've learned, what I've been, what, you, what I've heard on this show <laughs> is that if the guy is not married, it's not the same commitment as it is if he was married. Now, David Letterman was not married. He might have been going with somebody or hanging with somebody, but he was not and married also, to her. He was with, he was with so her for a long is, time. We don't know what kind of understanding he and his, me. at the time, his girlfriend had being saying. together for so long Listen, and he, he wasn't was married. With this woman. With he was with this woman for more than 20 years. Right. I am with Steve for 27 years. If he, uh, Okay, he's retired. He's not going to meet anybody but the Dunkin' Donuts girl, but still. <laughs> if he were to start an affair oh. with the Dunkin' Donuts girl, he would be out on his ass, but okay? You could not take him to court. That's, that's, that's a different. That's that's different. Sure. That is, but that's sure. a huge difference. One of the things that David Letterman did, and I thought he was very honest, and I hope we can just put the, you know, he said... I don't know what the situation's going to be with my wife. That's I've right. got a lot of work to that's do. Right. Yeah. If you're talking about whether or not you stay with a man if he cheats, that's one thing. Mm -hmm. If you're talking about sexual harassment, that is not the same thing. Mm -hmm. There is no record that we know mm -hmm. of of sexual yeah, harassment yeah. on All that right. show. Um, I wasn't I said, talking I legally. Been on it, and I've seen the women producers who might talk to and the women writers and so on. And they've advanced. Um, uh, well, they haven't advanced that's, because of that. That's that's just you know what, Bill, Clinton, Bill, Clinton, Bill Clinton was very good to women also in many ways. I mean, just because he promotes all the not, women on his staff is, doesn't that, mean that he was not doing favoritism but it to a couple it, of yes, them. Yes, it does mean. If it you does. cannot say... Def, he fired you her. cannot say that she got this because she... I'm sorry. <laughs> you can't say it. You know, you can't say it definitively. Can't say she didn't. 
You can't she say did. definitively. Got, you can say he was married if, he, if we're going to rehash married. that for the thoughts. No, Let's if you're talking about Clinton. You can talk about relationship, faith, trust, marriage. That's not the same as sexual harassment. And that's what we're trying well, to make clear. there are clear. many, you know, definitions of it. We should get a lawyer on the show. I mean, there are many definitions. Well, all I know is he wasn't married, so... Whatever he has to, he's married now, and now he really has to clean it up. Right. Okay, but and when he, he was he doing has. what he was doing, he was he was he had not made that commitment. And having listened to y'all for two years, I know that as long and as that ring is on his finger for so long, you like know I don't see? stay long enough. Well, they're <laughs> going, they are married. Like, aren't they t- legal? Like, doesn't the law consider well, you guys? No, uh, I don't common think there's such a thing as common law anymore. I think they took it. I don't know if it's still here. We have a moral and an emotional commitment to each other, which is the same thing as being married. Maybe better. Can I just say one thing? Because it's your case. It's better. Can I just say one thing? Because it's your birthday, and you're so cute, and you know I love you. Steve is adorable. He is adorable. People haven't seen he's a great guy. Him, he's I'm a not jumping guy. him so fast. No. <laughs> no. no. Yeah. No, you wouldn't. Guy. Because yeah. everybody makes mistakes. Donuts, bitch. Better stay away from him. <laughs> Thank you.